have so much skin. Shut up, Meg. Damn, she wet. It's moist. Hang on. Can't see the screen. I don't know what just happened, but apparently there's a lot when you record. The window has to be open because the cord comes through, and you're just gonna get a little bit moist. Are you, are you cold? Hang on, I'll get your coat. It must be in the other car. So, we're gonna go check it. Apparently the vehicle I've left the coat in is in here. I assume it's up at, up at one of the other properties. Um, so, we're gonna go up and check and get Typo's coat for it. So we're going up to feed. We were, I was meant to do it yesterday when it wasn't raining, but the alternator in this suit decided to die yesterday, so it's not a lot I can do about it. The car with Typo's coat in it does not appear to be here, so I assume it's out in the paddock somewhere doing something. Oh no, there it is up there. Yeah, Typo, I've got bad news for you. You're not getting your coat. Comments? I think I've fed the sheep. I can't see in the mirror. Uh, yep, they have. Excellent. Right, next paddock. Fuck, this gives me the shits. They've got all of this space to run around in, but yet they choose to run right in front of the car. I just thought I'd share with you a bad decision I made, was getting this jacket, not because of the lamb diary colour, that's quite convenient, especially when you're getting shat on while sheep's giving birth. No, it's the fact it doesn't have a hood. As you can see, this paddock's just getting seated at the moment. I will see if Jackson can send me a POV of what that looks like. We shall see. We burnt that paddock yesterday or the day before. It's getting seated today to re reduce the amount of erosion that will happen normally we don't burn i did do a video on this for my members only so if you hang on we're skidding i did do a video on this for my members if you would like to watch it feel free there are all the nudies now including typo because i can't find her coat sucks to be hurt what i'm trying to do when i'm feeding is roughly work out make sure every ewe has their head down and is able to get a decent feed so we're looking for distance between them sometimes you just have sheep and all of that there all of that gap there is full of grain and they're just greedy they're just greedy little goblins all right Fat lambs. Gotta shut this gate or they will. Why is that so crooked? I will say I'm glad I'm wearing my waterproof pants. Otherwise, I would have some wet unders. Move, 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 move. Thank you. We do give these ones a little bit extra because we are actively trying to put two kilos a week on these lambs. I saw a TikTok where if you put um, toothpaste on a mirror, it won't fog up with the glass. I assume it's like in a chemical reaction. Or I need like little windscreen wipers on the mirrors. That would, that would work too. What do you think? She licked my fingers. I saw you licking your asshole this morning. I was just turning around on this um, stubble and <laughs> I thought we weren't going to go anywhere, but we are. We managed to get off it. I did hear the wheels turn several times. Oh, there's some string. We have to chuck this off in here because they didn't get enough feed, so we'll give them this. I will use the GoPro because I don't need my camera getting moist. So I just put all this grain out on camera and the cart fucked up. So the sheep will pick through this. They'll eat what they want. They'll leave what they won't. They are eagerly awaiting me to leave, so I'll leave now and they can have a munch. Then I think we've got one more mob to feed. Two more mobs to feed, I lied. Three more mobs to feed, I lied again. What position is that? <laughs> that cannot be good for your back. Why are you in cat loaf position? I think you've been spending too much time with the cat to fill the bin up with the grain flying everywhere and it's because it's wet it's gonna stick it's gonna stick to me 
Lovely. What? Dude, why are you sitting? Topo. Topo. Dude, are you good? Can't feel my fingers. I'm going to sit in the ute and wait because it's cold. That one at the front just there, he just slid all the way down to the bottom because it's just so wet. I, I was hoping they'd continue coming to see if I could catch it on camera, but I don't think I'm going to. All of a sudden, it's just so windy. That is the last lot fed. Not sure what we're doing now. I will go and find out. Uh, that That's an interesting choice to put that one there on the track. Found the car which the coat is in. I don't know why it's got the luxury of being in the shed all of a sudden. However, Typo will now not be a chilly slug. Are you happy I found your coat? Are you happy now? Typo's harness arrived, but I, I don't feel like we're going to use it today and it's very disappointing because it looks great. Come on. Oh yeah, sure, I forgot. You're a little princess in the coat, so she needs to be lifted in. Come on. What are you doing? I don't want to see your cooch slug. I haven't really been given instructions on what I'm feeding, so I guess it's choose your own adventure. It's nice find the bale, it's not windy. I'm just gonna give a bale to these nudies because they look a bit hungry and they've been trying to get into that hay shed behind me. A big reason why we feed so close to stuff like dams and on the edges of paddocks is so when this paddock does get sown for cropping we don't we minimize the amount of weeds that we're going to get i was having a bit of trouble walking and then i looked down and i was a bit tied up mm, kinky just dropped some duct tape off Apparently something broke on the cedar, so we're temporarily fixing it. Just got to pull this off real quick because one of the tires on one of the small trucks has, is, is totally fucked. So I've got to go into town after lunch and get the tire replaced. Contributions doing a lot. Well, this one's telling me that to tighten it up would be that one. Oh, you fuck it. Lunchtime. So it was a fucking ordeal and a half to get this thing off, but it's off now, so we're heading in. I need to strap Typo in. Okay, we ready to go? Cool. What's the side eye for? What did I do to you? Arrived into the tire place. Oh shit, that flew open. Just gonna go and get them to take a look at it and we'll get this done. I don't know why my face is dirty. Tire's been taken away. Now we wait. We've got the new tire. We're about to head back now. Not sure what we're doing for the rest of the afternoon. We shall see. So we'll head back. The squeaky wheels are out in force. We're moving sheep from this paddock into that paddock. But what makes it special is we've got slug cam. That's your front, that's your titty covers. It goes around the back. We will go down to the sheep, turn it on, and we'll see what happens. And there they go, job done. Come here, come here. Good job, good job. I'm disappointed it just doesn't really stay. <gasps> no! Are you serious? Why the fuck has it done that? I try to do something nice and get some great content. And this is what happens. I just need to produce garbage. I think I've lost all the footage that I've filmed today. Are you serious? 
We're back at the tractor. Dad wants two more um, mobs fed. Just feeding out the last bale. It would be fantastic if it would unravel. This next part is something I wouldn't normally show. Uh, chocolate, chocolate. I've had chocolate since I was 11 and this was the last night that I fed him. He was put to sleep Friday the 28th of April. You make the decisions for your pets all throughout their lives and it's very important that you make that last decision for them so they don't suffer.